Another new model at the show here. The 28 Bertram center console. It's nice to see Bertram going back to its roots, building some smaller boats. You know, Bertram didn't start out with the big battle wagons, which is a term I really am not very fond of. My fellow editors at PMY always give them grief. But, you know, Bertram had that sort of quintessential big step shear convertibles. Um, but they really made their name in the smaller boat market. 25 and 28. It's got a nice seating area up front. And this is a perfect family boat. And, of course, fishing. Really, really nice. We were out on the 39 a few weeks back, which is right there, right next to this one. Another gorgeous boat. Um, didn't know this was going to be here, though, the 28. It's nice to see. Nice helm station. Got the glass dash. Cockpit. Looks like a fold-down seat. She's got twin 300 Mercs on it. Another live well back in that corner. Looks like a big tackle station right behind the right behind the helm seat. And Yeti, which looks like it slides out there. Um, under that hatch, I'm guessing is some um, lazarette space, perhaps a sea keeper. So here we go, stepping into the 28. It's got this real nice uh, side door. It makes boarding really easy. Of course, you can uh, swim and pull fish in through there too. This is a cool touch. Got a live well in the gunnel. Uh, you, a lot of builders are doing this now with the swim step area, extending that further aft so you can get access to the motors. Also makes uh, getting in and out easier and, and maintenance easier. You can, I'm sure you can get the motor up and pop the cowling off and do all that. Nice little seat back here. I'm curious what's under this big hatch. Let's take a look. Okay, we got access, so that looks like your tank. Uh, big lazarette space. All your fuel filters. All your fuel filters here. Strainer. Gotcha. Got your pull-out Yeti. I'm sure this is some fish box. Now this is nice to see here. You see the step in the in the shear. That's sort of a Bertram trademark, and I'm glad that they kept that going. Nice handrails moving forward. Big helm. This is a really nice helm for a 28-foot center console. Twin Garmin screens. Very clean. Plenty of room to mount a few more things. Nice wheel. Additional seating up in the bow, of course. It looks like some storage under all this. More storage down there. And those, I'm sure that's probably for a table. So, this being a new boat, we have a lot of questions to ask. We can find out all that info. What do we got under here? Okay. So, 
opening up the hatch. Oh, got a nice size head in here. Let's see how much room we got. Okay, well, I'm six, or I wish I was six feet. I'm five foot eight, and there's probably a good four or five inches over my head. Got your pull out sink so you can hose yourself off, take a little shower. Got a wet head drain down there. Um, marine toilet, little window. Nice teak accents on the tread. Very nice. So there you go, folks. That's the 28 Bertram center console. Nice to see Bertram getting back to its roots and building some smaller boats for the, the real hot center console market. We're gonna make sure to see trial this boat at a further date and give you a full report on what she does with those 300 horse mercs and have some fun. Hopefully catch some fish or take the family out for a spin because that's what this boat's built for. Stay tuned and make sure to check out pmymag.com for more. Thanks.